And good morning again, people. And I'm back with another bit of uh, what we like to call in this part of the woods. Useless information. And some of it not, might not be so useless. This is uh, <clears throat> where words again. We're going to do the words things. Some of the stuff is a little bit long to read. I might do that uh, at some point one day. Where words, a quiz, knight's life, spelt like, you know, knights in shining armor with the lances and the, and the armor and all that stuff. Uh, and this word is dragon. Where did the word dragon originate from? Uh, and, and your choices are A, in honor of Ottoman leader Torgud Dragon, who fought a legendary fire breather. Mm. B, the serpent dragon, described in Homer's Iliad. Maybe. Uh, C, the dragon's mythical breeding grounds in Dragon. Dragon, Denmark. So there are your choices. I don't know the answer either. So uh, we will come back to this after we're done. Hopefully I'll remember to do that. Because <laughs> you know sometimes I forget these things. But in the meantime, we are going to uh, listen to some... Uh, this is not a request. Uh, Return to Forever. Uh, and uh, Chick Corea, uh, Al Dimiola, I believe Lenny White on drums uh, on bass is, oh dear, I'll have to find that out, and I'll put it in the uh, description, uh, but uh, this particular tune is called Medieval Overture. You see how unprepared I am? Seventy six by the by. Alfonso Johnson, bassist. Why can't I remember that? Stanley. Not Stanley Jordan. No. I don't Thank you. 
get back to our question at hand. The question was, where words, where did words come from? We asked, where did the word dragon come from? And your choices were, uh, in, in, in honor of Ottoman leader Torgan Dragon, who fought a legendary fire breather, B, the serpent, Dracon, described in Homer's Iliad, Iliad, I should say, C, the dragon's mythical breeding grounds in Dragon, Denmark. All right, let's see, and that's two. B. Agamemnon carried a shield with a picture of a dragon as he led the Greeks in the... What? <laughs> How can that be? That's what it says. 2B. Agamemnon. Right. Agamemnon. <clears throat> carried a, a shield and a picture of the dragon as he led the Greeks in the Trojan War. Well, that doesn't really, uh, I don't know about the, the serpent dragon described in Homer's Elite. Okay, maybe, uh, all right. I got it now, I got it. So there's your answer. So now you know where dragon came from, the word dragon from Homer's Iliad. And uh, so apparently um, Agamemnon carried a shield with a picture of a dragon as he led the Greeks in the Trojan War. But it sounds like it already had the name. If it, it, well, I'm totally confusing the matter here. Never mind that. We'll get a better one next time. Okay, hope you enjoyed Return to Forever. If you've never heard them before, check them out because they are worth listening to if you're kind of a prog sort of a person. And jazz, they can get into some jazz too. So jazz, prog, kind of a mixed thing. So it's very interesting. Later, gang. <laughs>